last year, the state of North Carolina became the most recent state in the country to pass a marriage amendment. By an overwhelming 61% to 39%, North Carolinians amended their state constitution to say that marriage between one man and one woman is the only valid domestic legal union. In a state where only 35% of the voters are Republican, that means it took a substantial majority of Democrats and independents voting for marriage as well. We, we are, after all, the state of Billy Graham. We are, after all, the state that forced President Obama out of the closet on this issue of gay marriage. The vote in North Carolina represents the very essence of the democratic process. The people voting to affirm a core value and building block of society, marriage. And this vote proves one thing, we can win. In North Carolina, the people recognized with this historic vote that marriage comes from God and that neither the government nor the church have the right to redefine it. Yeah. Marriage provides benefits to society that no other relationship can. The fact that children need both a mother and a father is self-evident. Just look at the devastation of the breakdown of the American family. Why would we want to create, by very definition, families that are broken from the start because of the fact that the children from those families are denied either a mother or a father. The needs of children should not be pushed to the back of the bus by changing the very paradigm which God created for their entry into the world and their growth to maturity. It is wrong for this court to upend the voters' decision in North Carolina and in the other 40 states where marriage is between one man and one woman. The Supreme Court should seize the opportunity to uphold the laws and return authority to the citizens and to their elected representatives. If there's one lesson that Roe versus Wade taught us, it's that the court should not determine the final outcome of highly debated and volatile social policies. That alone belongs to the people. And if there's one lesson that people who support natural marriage should learn from North Carolina's victory last May, it's that we must work tirelessly together. The Catholics, the Protestants, Jews, people of all faiths, the Republicans, the Democrats, the Tea Party, those who don't even care about politics, whites, blacks, Latinos, people of all races, when we work together, we can win. Finally, as God told the Israelites, do not be afraid or discouraged because of this vast army, for the battle is not yours, it's God's. Thank you.